Welcome back to Let's Play The Signal. The DLC chapter for Alan Wake. Again! I'm Burning Dog Face, and, uh, last time, I eventually made my way through the church basement and unlocked that achievement I missed ten years ago, even if it did require me to become extremely fixated on it in order to get it. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Uh, at the end, uh, we discovered that uh, Thomas Zane had left us a single manuscript page. Rather than just being something for us to read, it exploded into words, which triggered into a number of not terribly helpful phenomenon, like causing an earthquake, hearing an echo of Alice's scream, uh, summoning the goddamn, uh, cardboard cutout of me. And, of course, the oh-so-helpful half a wall. I just wanted to enjoy it for a moment there. Finally, finally we get to find out if this was all just a big waste of time, or if, uh, Zane's idea of friend is, uh, any more applicable to our situation. Barry? Hey, bestseller! Looking good! You... you... you're not real. Well, oh, no boy. shit, what gave me away? What, the see-through thing? I'm a figment of your imagination, just like pretty much everything else you see here. Maybe even you. That's insane. Yeah, you're right. Everything that happened before made perfect sense, but this is insane. Good catch, Al! <laughs> okay. Okay, look, I gotta get going. The GPS. The GPS, yeah, I know. Follow the signal. Got it. Uh. So, anywho, I'm here to help you out now. The thing is, you need to get a grip, all right? You nag the way the real Barry does. You know that? Well, hey, you know, be fair. It's not my fault you think I'm annoying. I don't think you're annoying. Ah, baby, relax. It's cool. Just try to stay on the ball here. You need to do what Zane tells you. He's been here for ages. He's like the expert. Well... Uh, I anyway, guess that makes sense. Anyway, if this is insane, and it's all from your mind, what's that say about you? Fine. Enough. I can't believe I was actually happy to see you. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't shit a shitter, Al. Deep down, you're always happy to see me. Can't lie to yourself, know what I'm saying? I must be a sucker for punishment. You? No, really? And I always thought you went out of your way to avoid trouble. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for that. Well... That wasn't just like the echoes of Sarah that unlocked the, the church. That was like... That was a construct. They took everything Alan knows about Barry and made a recreation. It's not Barry Wheeler. It's... It's Alan Wake's perception of Barry Wheeler, which means he's slightly more naggy than the real one. But he I guess that means he means well, and he does have Alan's best interests at heart. Huh. Okay, it was literally a friend. I might have saved that one for last on purpose. <laughs> I mean, I've got one, but the last time I did this, it gave me a better one, so... Ah, oh, the lantern. I don't know why it surprised me that it doesn't fall. It just does. Oh, yeah, sure, I'll just jump twice my height and grab that. Oh. Oh. Well, that did it. Ah, the lantern. You know, I beat the game with this thing. It wasn't even the heavy-duty lantern at the end. Maybe I missed that. There were a couple of... Ch I think there was one chest I didn't find. I can just check. No, there were three chests I didn't find. Accompanied by a ghostly version of Barry, Wake continues to follow the strange GPS signal. 
Huh. Maybe Tom knew that... that uh, Alan needed Barry's company to keep his mind focused, to keep from going insane, from going deeper, whatever that means. Of course, none of this answers the really interesting question, which is, who the fuck is the other Alan? So once again, this will burn the dark off faster, but it will drain more quickly than the uh, heavy-duty uh, flashlight I need. Well, I'm almost full, but sure. Hey. Perfect! Not a battery wasted. Well, maybe that one I just used. That could be argued. <laughs> but I got four lithium batteries out of that. I think the signal's pointing towards that thing in the distance. Yeah, that'd be the Biltmore Sawmill. How the hell do you know that? I don't know anything you don't. So why don't you ask yourself that? Huh? Oh. Maybe you saw a sign for it back in the real world, or maybe it's the sawmill, because I said it's the sawmill, and now you can't get it out of your head. Fantastic. Yeah, it sure has given me a headache. Or is that... Your headache? Do you have a headache? Barry? Dude, we're bonding! This imaginary Barry is, uh, weird. I really like that he's openly c contemplating the, uh, the nature of this place. Let's just, let's just, let's just turn the meta up all the fucking way. Let's do that. Good, you can't cut through that shit. I hate that. Yeah, this looks like a really safe place for me to go. Oh, this is more. Fuck. Boom, you say. I think all that screaming was enhanced more than usual because- and it only started after I hit that scream. What is that? Wood breaking or the predator? But yeah, you know, is it, is it that you saw the sign in the real world and remember it subconsciously? Or is it just because Barry said so? Really? I was sure that was going to be like a red barrel, and I needed to wait for the Taken to appear. But okay! Fire in the hole? Complete that sentence, you're fired. You're mightier <laughs> than the sword. You're fired. Aww. <laughs> and he just blinks out. I also like that, that they don't, like, make any secret out of the fact that he's not real. He just... Oh, I don't like the fact that it has a voice. Well, I guess it did have a voice when I confronted Barbara at the end, didn't it? There was a man's voice overlapping hers. I think that was just what the Dark Presence sounds like. I don't think it's a man. I think that's what it sounds like, is what I mean. It had a male voice actor, but, uh... fucking grenade going off. I wonder if there's any invisible paint here. Well, maybe there will be now that I've said that. That would be... Ugh. A subjective place. How the fuck do you keep from going insane? Okay, fuck that noise. Literally. I'm full of batteries. But I very much appreciate this. Ammo check. Not bad. Hey, you feel coming. It's not even flesh anymore. Just shadows and ghosts and moths slicing through his 
Oh, fuck! Yeah, that did nothing! Back! Oh, a real person. Oh, God! Okay, so now the Taken are just conceptual. That's fucking awesome. I can barely see what they're doing. I heard that! Oh, they're fucking coming again. I can't even see him. There he is. Boy, I sure hope none of the Taken come back. Hey guys, my eyes are closed. I'm standing here with my eyes closed. Uh oh. Excuse me. I couldn't tell if I beat him or not. Ooh! Why are they making coughing noises? Ah, oh, fuck! No! I gotta move, these things are never going to stop. God damn log. Well, this one I have to know about. God damn it. Oh boy. No. I thought if I could set that off, it would burn them all at once. Or maybe it would shoot fireworks up into the sky, and I would accomplish nothing. Hey, now I remember that this game is scary. <laughs> Fuck. And towards the end of the game especially, uh... You know, I realized that I actually took longer this time than I did the first time I played this game. I thought there would be way more videos because a lot of them were like 10 minutes long. And I realized after I beat the game that the reason for that, the reason I took longer this time, it's because I wasn't as scared this time. The first time I was genuinely so afraid that I vividly remember moments where it's like, I should be looking around for pages and thermoses. But this forest is scary as shit, so fuck that, I'm just gonna keep walking to the light. Oh hell, that was too far. I didn't think I thought they would all cluster up around it. Okay, I'm trying to move when it's doing that is really uh confusing. Fuck! Excuse me. I don't remember asking you to do that. 
And we're running, and we're running. But not for very much longer. Excuse me, pardon me. Uh, that didn't work as well as I hoped it would. No, you don't! Oh, pump! I'm gonna see a pump action shotgun! God damn it, pick it up! What is the deal here? Why isn't it working? Okay, bitchin'. Oh god. Hey, shithead. Here's looking at you. Oh, Christ! I'll never find anything in all this nonsense. I don't even know if I'm looking for anything. I feel like this would be a good spot to stuff a clock. Lord knows I'd never hear the ticking. Oh fuck, this is where I came from! I need you guys to stay back there while I kill your friend. Oh god! Yeah, there's a bunch of them. Get it! Get it! What? Oh, he walked into it! I did see- no, oh, tools. But, you know, I was gonna say, but that was before I started spinning all around. Feed my guns! Oh, more fireworks over there. More boom. I'm just seeing the flickering around those things. No, don't run into it, you idiot. Don't! Don't! It's a friz it's a possessed fridge. I don't know what I was what I thought might happen. I was even telling myself not to do it. No. Oh. Uh, thanks. Doesn't usually happen. Oh, it is you! Shit! I thought you might have been the remains of the other guy. Okay, I'll take that, but I was kind of hoping Barry Allen would appear. Uh 
Oh shit! Hey, here's an idea. Fuck you. I don't think I got him. Oh, there's the uh, timer. Let me turn that off. Is that a tent? It is a tent. I guess it doesn't need to make sense, huh? Turret! Oh boy! This is gonna be interesting. Christ. This place is crazy go nuts. And pieces of a bridge are flying around. Fucking great. <laughs> Can't quite hit it from here. Oh boy. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'm gonna take a moment to just breathe here. So I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play The Signal, the DLC chapter for Alan Wake. Again. <laughs>